I want to ask you uh, about Iran. We don't have diplomatic relations with Iran, but we know that the IRGC, uh, because it is not a listed terrorist organization, uh, is able to operate here in Canada to recruit, fundraise, promote, uh, etc. Uh, do you believe that the IRGC is a terrorist organization? Why hasn't your government shut down their operations in Canada? So, first and foremost, when it comes to Iran, I must say that we're all very uh, supported and moved by the uh, courage of the Iranian people, particularly the women and girls. Um, and we've been, and I've said it before, you know this, Garnet, but I think for Canadians watching us, it's important for them to know. Iran is a state sponsor of terrorism under a criminal code. Uh, we have some of the strongest measures against them. We've sanctioned many of the Iranian regimes and uh, RGC members themselves. We also host and we chair every year uh, right. the you, you know my time is very tight. IRGC terrorist I listing. I must say that the Prime Minister mentioned recently that we are looking at ways to designate the IRGC as a terrorist organization. What are the impediments? Well, why not just do it? Because we're a government that takes decisions that are thoughtful and that we are undergoing an international security crisis right now. And so when we take decisions, we know that there can be consequences. But, but and that is Iran is at the we heart of that issue. security crisis, but right? I know that many Iranian Canadians... It's been, it's been six years since you voted in the I House to list. Finish your response, please. Mr. I Mr. Chair, it's, it's my time, and you know that. Iranian Canadians are concerned. We know that the RGC is involved in terrible activities, not only in Iran, across the region of the Middle East, and we're concerned about Iranian Canadians here. And so that is why we're looking at the, into the issue, because it's very concerning. Thank you, thank you Minister. I, I would just say that you voted in the House of Commons to list them as a terrorist organization almost six years ago. Uh, that's a very, very long time to be sitting on this. 